it is time to talk about the Autel Evo 2 Enterprise 640T. I got it right here in my hands. We're gonna talk about it, don't go anywhere. Hey everybody, David here from Aerial Influence. Thank you so much for stopping by. Today we're talking about the Autel Evo 2 Enterprise 640T Dual. I think I got that right. I'll put the correct name up, but we're talking about this drone right here. It really is an incredible piece of technology. And today we're gonna to talk about it on its own merits. We're not comparing it to anything else, any of its competitors. We just wanna see what this drone has to offer. So let's get started. Okay, first up is flight time. Now, Autel says it's gonna get about 41 minutes of flight time if there's no wind, if it's just flying in perfect conditions. So realistically, you're looking at probably 35 minutes of flight time. So that's a great flight time for a small drone like this. Next up is an obvious one. It's that high resolution thermal camera. So you can see it right here. I'll hold it up close. That has both an 8K camera in it and a high resolution thermal camera. So I think uh, anybody that purchases this drone is gonna be really happy because you're getting the best of both worlds. You're getting 8K. A lot of you are like, why would I want 8K video? What am I gonna do with it? Well, you can edit with 8K uh, using proxies. You're gonna have to look that up. But if you look up proxies, it's gonna teach you how to use these large files and sort of dumb them down for your computer uh, and then reconnect them later. So check that out. And it's nice to have 8K because you can crop in. So maybe you weren't so close to an object. Uh, you can now crop in and put that into a 4K timeline and your video is still gonna have the same high resolution. And this thermal sensor, you can't really say too much about it because it's just incredible. 640 by 512, so that is the highest resolution you can get right now on the market, on a drone, especially this size. Man, this thing is very, very small and compact. I'm talking about the camera itself, not even talking about the drone yet, uh, but this camera is small and compact and it houses a ton of technology. We've got some crazy geese going over our heads right now. Hey, what's up? We call them Beth and Karen. Get out of here, Beth and Karen. Now that the geese are gone, okay, bottom line, this thermal sensor with the 8K camera in it are really impressive, uh, so definitely worth your money. Next up, let's talk about obstacle avoidance. This thing has 360 degrees of obstacle avoidance around it, so very, very safe. Now, what we always say about obstacle avoidance is it's good to have it. It's like a seat belt or an airbag. It's great that it's there, but you never wanna have to use it. But this thing is exceptional in the fact that it does have all of these sensors around it, on top of it, on the bottom of it, behind it, in front of it. Everywhere you wanna look, there are obstacle avoidance sensors. So that is another great feature of this Autel Evo 2 drone. Next up, it has ADS-B in. That means it is going to tell you if there is an airplane overhead, if there's an airplane coming into your airspace so that you know that you need to, to lower yourself to the ground, get that drone as low as possible to the ground just in case it is a low flying airplane or helicopter. It's giving you that warning that, hey, there is something close by that you need to get away from. Also wanna talk about the zoom range on this camera. So not only are you getting 8K, but you're getting a 16 times zoom range on it. Now that's four times lossless, which means you're gonna be able to zoom in four times before the image starts to disintegrate, starts to go downhill, because once you get into that digital zoom, it's gonna start breaking up on you a little bit, start digitizing, you're gonna be able to see that the quality just isn't there. But you do have a 16 times, man, there's so much noise going on out here. Sorry about all the distractions here. You are going to have a great zoom. That's the basic point. You're going to have a 16 times zoom on it. Uh, the quality will disintegrate as you go further and further, but still great to have that 16 times zoom. Also got to mention that you get a great zoom range on the thermal camera as well. So both of these, this, this camera, this camera right here, this, this gimbal is what we call it. It's got two sensors on it and boy, is it powerful. Uh, I just walked through some of the great things it can do, but really a lot of great technology packed into just this little package. Next up, we wanna talk about deployability. So one of the main things is you wanna be able to get this thing out and up in the air as quickly as possible. And you can do that with this Autel drone. You can get this thing out of the box 
on the ground, get everything turned on and ready to go within a minute, get that thing up in the air and you are ready to go. Another great thing about this Autel Enterprise drone is that they've included all the smart features that you would see in the consumer drone. So like follow me and tracking, uh, that kind of thing, orbit. Those are all included in this drone where in some of the other competitors, they're not included. It was nice that Autel included it here because I think, especially like orbit, that could be used for a lot of professional purposes, for like inspection purposes. So it was nice that Autel included that in this package. We also want to talk about the accessories. So the accessories that go on this, you can see this. This looks a little different, doesn't it? This is a little speaker we have on top here. So you speak into the drone. The drone immediately projects what you're saying. So it, say it could be something like, you know, help is on the way, something along those lines. This drone can be a great tool. There are other attachments as well. You've got a spotlight, which is very powerful. And you've also got a beacon for night flying as well. Now you're probably going to want to get a second beacon and they're really cheap, just like a stick on beacon. Because at nighttime, you're generally going to you want to use a spotlight. So if you're using the spotlight, then you can't use the beacon that's on top. Shut up, Beth and Karen. Hey. So these attachments are awesome. Spotlight, speaker, and beacon. And the speaker especially is very, very powerful. So I was impressed with that. These accessories are very cool. Next up is the smart controller, folks. This thing is pure gold. It is, it's pure gold. To have something this size that is this comfortable in your hands, you can put the lanyard around your neck and you can pinch if you want to, but this is a great addition to this enterprise package. You've got a nine inch screen here, so you're gonna be able to see whatever you wanna see on this big screen without having to attach like your iPhone or your iPad or anything else. This really is a very useful smart controller. You've got your HDMI out on top so you can share it with other people. This really is, this smart controller is, is just top of the line. Another great thing that you can do with this drone is mapping. So if you're doing crash scene reconstructions, uh, something along those lines, you can get this drone up in the air. You can make the drone fly in an automated pattern uh, where it's gonna take all the pictures you need to take and then you can upload those photos to like Pix4D. Very, very fast, very, very efficient. Instead of taking like a total station out there, you're using the drone, getting it up in the air, flying your map and then getting out of the way so that traffic can get moving again. So the mapping functions on this drone are super, super useful. Another great feature of this drone is there isn't any geofencing. So with DJI and some of the other companies, you might get approval from the FAA to fly somewhere, but then you get there and find out that DJI has marked that as a no-fly zone. So then you have to jump through a whole bunch of hoops to be able to fly, and that is no fun. That's where the Altel drone really shines, is that there is no geofencing. Once you get that clearance from the FAA, you're good to go. You're not gonna have to worry about anything else. Now, you need to fly legally, you need to fly safely, but you're gonna have a much better chance of flying in some of those questionable areas than you would with like a DJI drone. All right, so let's end with price. The price on this drone is $9,200. Now that's all in. That's all your batteries, that's your smart controller, that's your waterproof case, that's all the accessories, everything for $9,200. Now, that might seem expensive to you, but I want you to keep in mind that a thermal camera, it just five years ago, a thermal camera by itself would have been eight to $10,000. So now you're getting a flying version with a whole bunch of extra features that you wouldn't have gotten just on that thermal camera five to 10 years ago. So this really is a great investment if you're doing search and rescue, if you're doing surveying, if you're doing inspections, the list goes on and on and on. It's a great tool for your profession. Now I went through this list there are other things, there are other great positives about this drone that I probably didn't get into, but just know we are very impressed with this drone. We've dealt with a lot of drones over the past six years, and we're really impressed with what Altel is doing. They are definitely up to par with some of their competitors, and they're actually doing some different things than their competitors. So great job, Altel. If you're interested in purchasing an Altel Evo 2 Enterprise Dual 640T, make sure you reach out to us. The information's on the screen. You can also scan our QR code. We appreciate you stopping by, and we will see you next time.